Hello, this is Oliver from Mount Peak Communications. Today we're going to be talking about Twitter advertising 10 best practices. You know, Twitter is a great place to advertise as there are literally hundreds of millions of people who use Twitter for all sorts of purposes. So this can be a great social media platform to pick up new customers or introduce some old customers to some new products and services. But if you're going to do this, there are some key ways to make sure you use your ads to reach as many people as possible, as well as possible. So let's check them out. A lot of, first of all, keep it simple. A lot of people want to pep things up with lots of hashtags or they want to fit in as much as they can in a single tweet. The problem with this is that there are times when too much is said. People using Twitter are in it for the short, simple tweets. The more tight and concise you make the wording, the easier it is to read and the less time the audience needs to digest it. The shorter you make it, the more likely your message will be read. Next, easy on the fluff. Sure, you can get by with more than 140 characters these days, but why attempt it? Yeah, you might be able to add six six hashtags, but that carries a risk as well. As stated before, a longer message often means that the audience is just going to move on without reading it at all. And too many hashtags can make your audience, take your audience away from the products that you want them to see and off to other places. You should definitely use your own hashtags to build originality and to strengthen the pipeline to your own business. So be choosy when it comes to your hashtags and your message, or you could do more harm than good. Urgency. It is sometimes all it takes is saying things the right way. Phrases such as limited time or this deal is only available until show that there is a need there is need to not wait. A sense of urgency is your way of getting more leads to act. When people know there is only a short period of time to take action, they are more willing to act now. Clear call to action. It is one thing for people to like your ad, but quite another for them to take action on it. How do they proceed if they don't know how? Well, a clear call to action takes care of that. By including a solid CTA, you leave no doubt in your audience's mind as to what to do next. Click a button, call, download, whatever it may be. Wanted to make that CTA even more appealing? Pep it up with stronger language. So rather than stating, sign up now, you could go with, Sign up today for a free guide. This tells the audience what they are in for, as well as throwing in free, which makes things a little more savory. Make mobile work. Yes, nearly every website is mobile optimized. However, there are still many that are not. And if your business website is not ready for mobile use, then be sure to select desktop only when you're advertising. But to be honest, you're really wasting your time and your advertising money in that case. With 80% of Twitter users checking their tweets on mobile devices, it would be a shame for your business to miss out on roughly 160 million audience members. Catchy visuals. They say the images are worth a thousand retweets, but that is only partially true. The trick to retweeting with visuals is to make them relevant, compelling, and high quality. If it doesn't relate to your tweet, then it should not be used. Use images that showcase what you are advertising, whether it is a service or a product. You can even use simple self-created images for your promotion of 40% off the next purchase. Don't forget to set goals. What are you trying to achieve in your campaign? What? 
You don't have a key performance indicator? How will you know how your campaign is going? When you start your Twitter campaign, you must choose a goal, and Twitter allows for many, from raising awareness, building engagement, to gaining followers and installing apps, you have choices. However, not only is this key for Twitter, it is important in all of your media campaigns. So take time to really think about your goals. This will help you structure your campaign and give your audience a quality experience that fits them. Polls and questions. Really conducting a poll or asking a question is all about building engagement. Typically, you as an advertiser want to get people to stop scrolling long enough to read your tweet. But even more engagement is all the better. Asking questions can help you bring in more of the audience, helping you get to know them as well as their needs and wants. You can add a poll by simply clicking the poll icon at the bottom of your screen. However, polls should not be considered an afterthought. Polls are for market research and in creating engaging conversations. So be sure to put some thought into your polls to get the most out of them. A, B, or more, testing. The trick here is to test your retweets. Your tweets, I mean. <laughs> No matter how good you think a video ad is, the best practice is to test that ad with two or three or four different ad copies. You can run a tweet with a video, a tweet with an image, a video with a web button, whatever you want to try, just vary it up. Different ads can hit different audience members in different ways on any given day. It is also important to get creative and try new copy with witty or playful wording to see how it plays with the audience. As always, be sure to keep that audience in mind. Make it timely. With nearly 20% of Americans getting their news from Twitter, one key to success is timely tweets. With so many users in tune with what is happening in the moment, you can take advantage by being part of the moment as well. You can tie it to the holiday that's happening now with event targeting, Whatever you want to do, you can use Twitter yourself to monitor the world's events and discover opportunities to tie your brand into what's going on now as well. So those are your 10 best practices for Twitter advertising. Be sure to use these anytime you're advertising with Twitter. And also be sure to like this, like and subscribe for further information on our Facebook channel or our Facebook 10 best practices, our LinkedIn 10 best practices, all of those that are coming soon. Thanks and have a wonderful day.